What's going on everyone? We are back with another video. What's going on everyone? We are back with another video. We are doing a system proficiency challenge again. So this is our fifth video uh, we are doing. What we're doing is we are trying to create the best team possible for each system proficiency and seeing which team is the best. Um, right now our best team would probably be our balance team. Uh, they went 68 and 14. Uh, they went 16 and 6 in the playoffs and they won a championship. Uh, the past two attempts are triangle system and seven seconds. We didn't win the championship. So again, that's the ultimate goal is winning the championship and just seeing if they're, uh, if that system is better. Uh, so in this ep uh, episode video, whatever you want to call it, uh, we're going to do grit and grind. I think that grit and grind is one of the harder systems to build around. Uh, there's, this is definitely the system with about probably the least amount of people who, um, are at least a three and a half star system rating uh but who knows maybe we'll be able to get it i think i think there's a lot of worse players who fit really well in this system uh so we'll see we'll see what happens we'll see if we can build this team uh to be really good um but i feel like this is definitely gonna be very similar to our uh to like a defensive team a really good defensive team i think a lot of good really good defenders fit um in the grid and grind system uh, so with that being said, we are going to randomly pick a team, and I'm going to stop in 3, 2, 1. We have the Boston Celtics. We're going to do a fantasy draft, of course. Um, we always do. Um, but we are not going to pick. We are just going to simulate uh, through the draft. I do want to see where we're picking. So this is significantly our best pick um, we've ever had. We usually get around 18, 19, 20, but it looked like we were... 13 so we were 13 um all right so this is the team we got we got joel and b cj fred van vliet davis pertons oh draymond green nerlens noel harrison barnes pat bev bismack doug deandre milos tedosic how are you pronounce his name michael k gilchrist uh diallo so we definitely have some pieces that are very good in the system. Uh, let's look at the system proficiency. Again, we are doing grit and grind. So three and a half stars. Let's see who's really good. So Joel and B is fantastic. Fred Van Vliet and Pat Bev are both really good. Um, same with Draymond Green. So all of them could be safe. Uh, Draymond Green, obviously I could have him come off the bench as a small forward, power forward. Um, I'd probably want a better point guard, starting point guard. Um, so I probably will trade Pat Bev, keep Fred Van Vliet. Um, but I'll see what I want to do. Again, Jimmy Butler is probably a guy I really want. Uh, he's five stars in the system, so, um, hopefully we can get him. Sweet. So the Pacers are rebuilding, and they do have Jimmy Butler. We are going to try and give them CJ. I just want to see if they have a counter offer. Okay. I just wanted to see, um, try and get a little lazy there. But Diallo has no trade value. Um, we're obviously going to have to give up this first round pick. Uh, let's look for a player that they would want. Maybe be a Nerlens Noel. Wow. They don't even want to do that. Let's give them another first. All right. So we gave up two firsts, CJ and Nerlens Noel for Jimmy Butler. Uh, but system proficiency, we are up to four stars already. Uh, Jimmy Butler is fantastic. Uh, Joel's fantastic. Fred Van Fleet, Pat Bev. This is actually pretty solid already. Uh, so... We really just need to upgrade our power forward, honestly, and then our bench. So I did try and get, um, who did I just try? I tried to get Eric Bledsoe, but he's on a title contender, so they didn't want to trade him. Wow. I don't know if he's worth uh, that much, so I'm going to have to figure out another guy to get. We might just have to start Van Vliet at the point guard. Maybe upgrade our shooting guard to like an Oladipo, see if I can get an Oladipo on this team. All right, so I went Bismack. They countered with this, a first and a second. I do want to see if I can just give them seconds. They'll do it for five seconds. <laughs> oh my gosh, we kept the first, we finessed. I don't understand how this is not um, four and a half. Look at this. Look at it. Everybody's almost full. Like, their meters are almost completely full. How am I supposed to get four and a half stars? This might end up being the starting lineup. This is probably going to be the starting lineup. I'm going to have to get bench players now. Oh, wait. I have to switch Embiid back to center now. Draymond Green to power forward. 
Oh my gosh, this just moved it to four and a half stars. I don't understand. I don't understand how this happened. Look at this. The word literally worse. Okay, starting lineup is good now. Um, because we can't. We, there's no chance we're gonna get Pascal Siakam. So we're just gonna get our uh, bench players now. All right. So Diallo, I can get a first and a second for him. I'm perfectly fine with that. All right. So 2K did crash on me. So I think we have the same team as we had. Um, I was trade finding some guys. Um, I believe it was Kill Kid Gilchrist. We were getting a first for it. Yeah. So the Phoenix Suns were offering a first. So I'm just gonna get all these first round picks and see who's rebuilding. All right. We're gonna go for Bam again. We had to pick up some free agents because we couldn't make any of these trades work. Um, okay, there we go. There we go. Two first round picks, Bertans and Joachim Noah, I think it was, for Adebayo. Now we have Adebayo and Pat Bev off the bench. All right, we need to get Jonathan Isaac. I'm willing to give up quite a lot for him. Two firsts and a second, still don't get it done. I'm willing to give up three firsts for him, honestly. There we go. Okay, we got him. There's literally no small forwards that we can trade for, besides like him, OG, and then everybody else is kind of significantly worse in the system, besides like a bunch of superstars, but we're not gonna get another superstar, because we can't. All right, I am gonna get Pau Gasol for Kent Bazemore. All right, so we can get a JaVale McGee for Pau and Milos, and I don't know if JaVale, JaVale doesn't fit the system, so we do have to flip him. And I am gonna upgrade to Michael Carter Williams and a second for Ed Davis in two seconds. So we can get Jakob Pertle in a second. I'm liking the moves. I'm liking the moves. So I'm going to trade for OG because he does actually fit the system. So Harrison Barnes and JaVale have to both go. And I need another good big man. And Harrison Barnes has a big contract. So I might be able to finesse someone. All right. So I got Andre Drummond. I gave up kind of a lot for him. I gave him Harrison Barnes, JaVale McGee, OG, and three seconds. But I need another big man. And he does fit the system. Uh, so I have to go to coach game plan. Him and Adebayo are coming off the bench. It's just what it is, man. It is what it is. Andre Drummond is actually four and a half in the system? Hold on. Hold on. Okay, now I want to know what happens if I start Joel Embiid and Andre Drummond. System proficiency is still four and a half stars. But I'd have to move Joel's position to power forward. Let's see. System proficiency is still four and a half stars. So I think I'm actually going to run this now. Okay, so I I think this is going to be the final squad. We got Van Vliet, Oladipo, Jimmy Butler, Joel Embiid, and Andre Chairman, uh, Bam Adebayo, Jonathan Isaac, Draymond Green, Pat Bev. Um, so that's it for the lineup. Starting lineup's really good. I actually think this is a, one of my better starting lineups. I am kind of going with the two big man cheese here with Joel Embiid and Andre Drummond. I actually might have to make Joel's back of a center too. Um, but then you got Adebayo coming off the bench. Draymond Green again is a shorter guy, so it's okay, but Jonathan Isaac is very tall. And he's actually a really good perimeter defender. So, so, I totally don't know what I was doing. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch the coach game plan. So defensively, defensive. Uh, neutral defensive thing, but we're gonna play physical defense. We got we got a squad who can play defense. Um, so yeah, I feel like I feel like that's good. Um, I'm gonna simulate through the season and see how we do. Again, I'm gonna bring up the numbers one more time. Uh, the regular season record to beat is 60 and 14. So we do end up going 67 and 15. We were one game behind our record of 16 and 14. So this is clearly a really good system if you get a good team together. And I kind of knew that because I built a lot of defensive oriented teams and this was obviously a very similar team. So these were the awards. Hey, we had CJ at the beginning of this and he ended up as a sixth man. Wow, I'm so sorry. Um, most approved, Jalen Brown, wow. And then of course we're coach of the year. Uh, we were Boston, so let's see if we have anybody. Joel Embiid on the third team, fantastic. Defensively, come on, Boston, Boston, Boston. No one, absolutely no one on any of those teams. Of course, we're the first seed. Um, league standings. So we were 13 games better than the Nets and a lot better than the Lakers too. So we are doing fantastic in the sim. Offensively, we were the second best team in the league. And defensively, of course, we were the first by a lot. 
always go with defensive oriented players who can all just good two way players I should say. But uh, these are what the stats are looking like. Joel Embiid almost 23 a game, nine and a half rebounds, two and a half assists. Fantastic. VO second leading score right there at 19 and a half. Uh, Jimmy Butler put up 16. Uh, he shot pretty efficiently too. He shot pretty efficiently. Uh, usually he doesn't shoot that efficiently, but uh, Fred Van Vliet, 14 points. Andre Drummond, 13, 11 and a half rebounds. Uh, just what I need, man. Bam Adebayo off the bench, 11 and a half. Pat Bev, eight. Draymond Green did his thing. Playmaking was four over four assists a game. That's really good. Um, and then Jonathan Isaac at six and a half, four and a half. Everybody did fantastic. Uh, everybody played their role really nicely. So we got Miami in the first round. I always like seeing if we have any weird. Oh wait, no, no, no. no. I'm I'm thinking of the 82 and 0 challenge. I usually do. I always look if there's any like weird teams in there because you know you take superstars away from people, but. We went to overtime in game four, uh, but we do win, of course. They were led by Kemba Walker and Bradley Beal. That offense is crazy, but that defense is god-awful. God-awful, but Joel Embiid led with 24-10. Bam, 24-8 off the bench. Uh, jo uh, Andre Drummond, 16-7. Dude, our three big men, our three big men were leading our team. That's like, that's funny. Uh, we got Detroit. Uh, who does Detroit have? George Hill, Clay Thompson, Kyle Anderson, Sabonis, Dwight Howard, man, they wouldn't trade us Dwight. They wouldn't trade us Dwight. Now I know why. But they have Al Horford off the bench, Serge, Alec Burt. Yeah, this team is not good at all. This team is awful. Uh, simulate round, 4 0. Oh my gosh. 4 0 them. Alec Burks was your leading scorer in the closeout game. That's hilarious. We only beat them by two, also. That's that's crazy. Joel and beat again, leading with 28 and 10. Andre Drummond, 18 and 9. 1 1 1 1 1. Uh, VO, fantastic, fantastic. He got those assists, he got those steals, man. Def oh my gosh, we are locking everybody down. We got Toronto in the conference final simulate round. Dang it, we lost the game, 2-1. I will simulate, just to see what's going on. We're up by a lot, we're not up by a lot. We win by two, um, Joel Embiid, close out. Not close out, sorry, just 32 and 11. I do, where is the game log? There we are. Uh, Beasley fouls, Brogdon, free throw made, free throw made. Okay, so out of bio. Okay, who scored last? Wow. Joel Embiid scored with 36 seconds left, and that was the last time he scored. Simulate round, 4-1. Uh, close that game, look like this, 24-8. and eight with Four blocks, oh my gosh, Joel. Stop playing with them. Victor Oladipo, 19, 3, 4, 3. Oh my gosh, look at the steals. Look at the steals. Five people got three steals. Joel with four blocks. Dude, you're just not scoring. You're art. We're amazing. Um, I'm going to simulate round. We're up 2 0. I want to simulate with Simcast just to see how we're doing. Um, maybe I want to go watch some gameplay. We're getting blown out. Ooh, not anymore. Ooh, this is the game. This is the game. This is the game to watch. Uh, two minutes left. We're up by two. I'm going to jump in. But we do have the ball. Someone inbounded. Holy crap. Jonathan Isaac back to Embiid. To Van Vliet. Oh, Van Vliet drives. Steps back. I hate that animation. Joel Embiid up close. Oh, we're going to get the offensive. Yep. Oh, my gosh. This game is so bad. How often is that called in real life? Not that often. But in 2K, every single game I watch, there's an offensive three seconds. And it's really annoying. Still up by two. Nothing really happened yet. Um, he's driving. Nope. He could have driven, but he didn't. He gets it down low to Carl Anthony Towns, but you got Drummond on? Yeah, all right. Um, Joel sets the screen, kicks it back out to him. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What are. Oh my gosh. Can we. Can we do something? Let's just not have a stagnant offense, man. Get it into him. Playing low to Joel. Oh, he gets around. He gets around him. Let's go. Joel, he's two, he's two feet tall. He's two feet tall next to you. I don't see how DiVincenzo is guarding Joel. It's just not happening. Uh, knocks on the second one. Let's see what's up. Let's see who's that? Devontae Graham, I'm assuming. I don't think there's another Graham that would be starting. Um, gets it down low to Towns. Terrible defense, but a worse animation. 
push it up oh my gosh why are we not pushing it up he gets it to jimmy oh jimmy with the dunk let's go let's go um yeah that's what i'm talking about carl anthony towns had a clear path to the basket and i know he's on the other team so i'm happy but i just hate that animation like in real life he just would have dunked it i don't know what he's doing uh carl anthony towns down low oh fouled carl anthony towns like He's, he can spread the floor, too, so I don't know what they're doing. I don't know what they're doing. Um, another big... Oh! Oh! Fred down to Joel down low, and the and one! Let's go! Reggie Jackson with the foul. He was a bum. And he is a bum still. See so Joel at the line. We're up by four. Very confident in this game now. Knocks down the free throw. Let's see what's up. Reggie, oh, okay. Yeah, they're going to lose. They got Reggie Jackson in in the closeout. Again, another screen. Down to Towns, down low, of course. Shoots it. Terrible shot. They get it out to Van Bleet, and they're going to foul. All right. So I think we're good with this game. Going to simcast now. Yeah, we win by three. Um, box score. Carl, Carl Anthony Towns put up 37. See, look at how many threes they shot. Look at how many threes they shot. Okay. He shot seven threes. Jackson shot seven threes. But when I was watching, there was not a three-pointer shot, man. We got game four here. Simulate with Simcast. Maybe we can hop in at some point. Oh, oh, it's a close game. Nah. Yeah, it's a close game. Eh. Wow, we're actually down again. Uh, hopefully we can get to two minutes and it's a close game again because I would love to hop in and watch again. Yep, we're up by two. We got the ball. We're gonna jump in. Also, let me know if you guys want me to keep like doing these jump ins. Like, I know some people don't do them at all. They'll just simulate through the series. But I don't know. I like watching the team that I build. So just let me know if you guys like that too, or you know, if it just takes too long. Uh, Cause it's not like good gameplay or anything. Like, look at that. That's awful. That's terrible gameplay. But I just enjoy watching them. You know, same scenario as last game. Exact same scenario. Another pick and roll. They're going to get to Joel down low. He gets the foul. Um, Jay Crowder, third foul. I feel like everybody's like three-point tendency needs to go up. Because that's how it is in real life. It's not like this, where they're just, you know, thrown in the post every single time. And also, we're running the same exact play. Both teams, same exact play. Out to, that's Tobias Harris. Another former Piston on their team. Oh, he's driving. He's driving. And he gets fouled. All right. I think he is when he tries. But he doesn't try enough. Let's see what's going on. Are we going to run the same pick and roll? Of course we do. Same pick and roll. Oh, Joel down low. Gets the ball to him. This is going to be an offensive three seconds. Yep. Oh. Terrible animation again. Just kick it out. Oh my gosh. I genuinely hate this game. Wow. Oh, he almost tied up. Oh, Carl Anthony Towns with the board. And honestly, that should have been an and one. That should have been an and one. But they tie it up. 55 seconds left. This is a game. This is getting exciting now. Maybe if we could run a decent offense. Yo, we got the mismatch. Oh, who was that? Who just drove? Oladipo, bro, with the clutch basket, man. Oladipo's clutch. He's underrated. He is underrated. He took LeBron to seven games a, a few years ago, man. Underrated. Was that two seasons ago now? Dang. I think that was two seasons. Was it? I don't know. All right. But Van Vliet with the clutch steal, but they stopped that fast break. Joel for the three. He, oh, man. He could have just sh absolute dagger right there. I hate how that's the three that they shot, though. All right. They got the switch. Carl Anthony Towns down low. No, bro. What is this defense? We do get last shot with 20 seconds left. Tie game, man. This is for the sweep, man. Let's see what happens. Oh, man. Come on. Fred Van Vliet, the player of the game, bro. What is everybody doing? 20 points. That's it? That's it, man. Let's see. Oh. Oh, man. Yo, you could have driven. Oh, my gosh. And they're going to run the same pick and roll. Oh, man. Is he trying to get it to Joel? I think he's trying to get it to Joel. Oh! Yo! 
Oh! Green light! Green light, Van Vliet. Clutch. 4.1 seconds left. Oh my gosh, bro. If that's not clutch, I don't know what is. They got the ball. Four seconds left, man. Are they gonna get the cat? Nope, they're gonna get the... Oh, cat in the corner. Oh, Devontae Graham. And he's not... He didn't get the shot up. He didn't get the shot up. Wow, bro. That's how bad 2K is. That's how bad 2K is. He made the basket, too. They're going to officially review it. He did not get that off, though. All right. So, Joel is your finals MVP at almost 30 points a game. Holy crap. Eight rebounds. Shot really well. Dude, look, he shot 52 from three. And he only took one three th those entire two games that I was while I was watching, of course. Uh, but closeout game... Joel dropped 26, Van Vliet 22, five, five ass assists, five steals. Oh my gosh. VO 18, three and four. Oh my gosh. This team was actually crazy. Um, so I'm going to write this down. I'm going to write this down. This is our new record holder for every record now. So we have the grit and the grind system type. Um, so in the regular season, we went 67. All right. So grit and grind system absolute success uh it's one game back from our regular season record of uh balanced we got 68 and 14 we did 67 and 15 here as far as the playoffs though uh it was significantly our best um i really think this is all about the two-way players so going forward i think that's what i'm gonna look for um when rebuilding teams um but if you guys enjoyed this video uh, make sure to like and subscribe and i will be uh doing more of these videos um let me check real fast so we still have perimeter centric we have post centric and then we have defense so we have three more of these videos so yeah be ready peace out